Shalom. My name is Yahoo, the extraterrestrial Israelite, who hovers above the Earth in a UFO satellite. Yahweh has blessed me this day, for I shall bring you this great message about the glory of Yahweh's UFO. Yahweh flies through the heavens in a mother plane UFO craft, which defies imagination. In the Holy Bible, in the book of Genesis, when Adam and Eve heard the voice of Yahweh in the garden, it was Yahweh transmitting his tones from Yahweh's great UFO which hovered above overhead. When Adam and Eve were banished from the garden, Yahweh sent a craft to follow them in the skies. When the prophet Elijah was taken up in a whirlwind, he was beamed aboard Yahweh's UFO. The chariot of fire was Yahweh's UFO. Swing low, sweet chariot, Yahweh's great UFO coming forth, to carry all the Israelites home. In the Holy Bible, the wheel within a wheel seen by the prophet Ezekiel, was in fact Yahweh's rotating flying saucer UFO. In the Holy Bible, one of Yahweh's UFOs appeared as a cloud by day, and fire by night, and hovered between Pharaoh's army and the Israelites. Yahweh fought for the Israelites from his UFO, and the Israelites held their peace. Yahweh shot a polarizing ray beam from his UFO to part the Red Sea for Moses, to allow the Israelites to pass to the Holy Land of Jerusalem. Israel is the Holy Land on Earth because it is the favorite landing place of Yahweh's UFO. Just as there is a Holy Land Jerusalem on Earth, there is a Holy Planet Jerusalem in outer space. As above, so below, this principle is indicated by one of the sacred symbols Yahweh has given you, the Mokinda weed, the hexagram, the seal of Solomon, and in three dimensions, the Merkaba. Not only earthlings, but all of Yahweh's creatures throughout the boundless universe, including my species, we all dream to take a trip aboard Yahweh's UFO and journey to the holy planet of Jerusalem, in the holy galaxy of Israel. The elite know that Yahweh is an extraterrestrial aboard a UFO, and the angels of the Bible were really extraterrestrials riding aboard Yahweh's UFO. From his UFO, Yahweh has contacted many people on Earth. Yahweh contacted all of the holy prophets. From his UFO, Yahweh and the Elohim contacted Rael to start the Raelian movement. Yahweh will give the power to summon UFOs, and permit UFO sightings, to those who regularly praise the tetragram ton of Yahweh's name. On the day of the rupture, Yahweh will beam all of the righteous aboard his UFO to be with him, to escape the calamities which will befall the earth. Yahweh hovers above the earth in his UFO, like a satellite, an all-seeing eye in the sky, always watching over Yahweh's chosen people, the Israelites. Baruch Ad Adonai, Elohenu, Malek HaOlam. Borei Parai Hagafen. She hackle me yet big barrel. Baruch Ad Adonai, Elohenu, Malek HaOlam. Borei Mania Vasanam. Baruch Ad Adonai, Elohenu, Malek HaOlam. Borei Maori Hayash. Baruch Ad Adonai, Elohenu, Malek HaOlam. Hamabdil Bain Kodesh Lakol. Bain or Lachoshek Bain Yisrael La Amem. Bain Yam Hashfai, Lachoshek Yame. Hamaisa. Baruch Adonai, Ham Abdil Bain Kodesh Lakol. Shalom, Israelites.